Hello everybody, today we're going to go over the FLIR TG165 and you can see that's ex exactly what you're looking at me through that right now. So, let's go. Are you alright or what? What? Yeah, oh, I you're scared you, I me you. with your Ebola. <laughs> Before we yep, get started you fine. guys, yeah. okay well we'll come back to that. The TG165 from FLIR, uh, basically what this is going to do is aid electricians stuff like that in their daily work. It's not a thermal imaging camera per and se. And how is it different than a thermal imaging? Um, it's different because obviously the price is cheaper, but it's basically, you know, spot guns you have? Yeah. You know, that you just point? It's basically one of those with like a thermal imaging overlay on it. Gotcha, it's like okay. a thermal imager, each individual pixel, pixel like measures temperature. So it's a lot more clearer picture then too, right? Yeah, on some, but that's just the resolution of the screen. I okay. mean, the resolution on this is, uh, 80 by 60, okay. you know? I mean, it says it's a true thermal imager. I mean, it's a, it, it is true thermal, but it's not, you know, gonna give you something like a $1,000, the E-series gotcha. okay. or whatever. Uh, basically what this is, you guys, is it's, think of it as the pointable uh, uh, image, imager. Man, now you got me all confused. <laughs> the thermal, think of it as the no contact thermometer with just the overlay on it. So with the no contact thermometer, you have to be searching all around. So let's say we got this saw. I'm looking for the hot spot. You know, I have to be going around here. Okay, it's not, whoa, wait a second. That's a little hot right there, you know? Okay. With this, it gives you the whole picture so you can see, whoa, I see warmth up here because the color is a little gotcha. brighter. Gotcha, okay. Um, so real cool couple things about this one year warranty it has a uh, S mini SD card right here on the top. So basically you can capture pictures. Capture pictures, date and time stamp and all that. Put it in your computer, email them off to people. Charges via USB. Comes with a USB charger but you can also plug it into a computer or anything like that. It's got a strap on the bottom so you don't drop it but it is uh, drop safe up to two meters. Uh, it is a rugged little unit, and like Eric said, I mean, it's got a really nice yeah, grip to it. to it. It's got like a really, if that was a drill, we, we would be like raving oh, yeah. about it. Yep. Um, but the cool thing about this, you guys, is, is it's not scary. I mean, I mean, a lot of thermal imagers, people are like, whoa, all kinds of different features, stuff like that. This is the, one of the most simple featured thermal imagers you've ever seen. We're going to go over it. I'm going to show you guys right now. Um, it does 13 degrees Fahrenheit to 716 degrees Fahrenheit. Uh, another cool feature, well, I'll show you that when we go over it. Uh, finds hot spots, real-time temperature updates, uh, temperature and infrared all in one, uh, adjustable emissivity levels. Eric was asking what emissivity is. Your default is 95.95. Emissivity is the ability of a surface to radiate heat. So water radiates heat differently than black steel. Gotcha. You know? Black painted steel. Um, all right, so that's about it. See the heat. That's pretty cool. Let's go over to I would be interested to see how their other one is too, like the yeah, the, the big E8. One that's, I know, you know I want to get it, or not an E8, but I want to get an E series. All right, you guys, hopefully you can see this. We're you want me to hold it? Well, yeah. No, I got oh, it. Oh, okay. You're, I want you to stand there because you're, oh. you're the only heat source we got. Ooh. You can pick your nose or whatever you do over there. Thanks. Okay, so real simple, you guys. We're going to hit the menu on this. There's the menu. The first one is uh, for, oh, hold on. We could go in and save. Oh, so these are some of the pictures that I've saved. There's my cat. That's cool. See the, the cold nose on the cat? Do you guys see that? So that's some of the stuff we saved. So we can go back and watch, look at our stuff on there. Uh, down here, we can turn the thermal to a uh, black and white image. So there's no colors. Look at the camera, Eric. That's kind of cool for night vision. Um, okay, then we'll go back to menu. Emissivity level, 0.95. Lasers, here's the lasers, this is cool. So, hold on, lasers don't come on yet until I pull the trigger. There's the lasers. See the lasers on Eric, you guys? Basically, what's between those two lasers is the temperature reading we're getting here. So yeah, kind of picture a circle around. Yeah, well, not, yeah. Well, yeah, because it's going to go down here. It's not okay. just between these two. Yes, Eric. And then in the center there, that's your actual reading right there. If you guys could see that little uh, crosshair, that's where the reading is on the actual image. Okay. <laughs> like I'm making a picture of like Bobby So as you see when I'm pulling the trigger, as soon as you release the trigger. Do you me off of there or are you doing no, it No, just here? stand there. It wants to save it, but we're not going to save it. So we just go right there. Let's go back to the menu. Laser on and off. Celsius Fahrenheit. Uh, we can turn that little crosshair on and off. Uh, auto time off, five minutes. The date and the info screen, which gives you all kinds of uh, like the revision, the firmware revision, and stuff like that. So, real simple unit to operate. We'll go back to the colored. 
real simple unit to operate, you guys. It's oh, pretty man. cool. What, are you getting cold? You're getting allergies or something. No, I think it's Ebola. It might be. Check me. Do I have it? Well, let me see. According to this, you're 91 degrees. That's Ebola. No, it isn't. That's the Ebola human body's 98.6. Something weird, though. I went to the doctor's for the checkup, and uh, she was taking my temperature, and I was exactly 98.6. She says that doesn't happen often, believe it or not. One-year <laughs> warranty. You can extend your warranty. It comes with this little card. You can go up to a two years on the uh, product and 10 years on the thermal imager. It goes to... Uh, uh, it's Florida. All you got to do is register it. You get an extended warranty. That's pretty good. Are they a U.S. company? I believe so, Eric. FLIR is known, I mean, this is low, this is small time stuff for FLIR right here. Okay. FLIR is known for helicopter, you know, uh, military, just seen in the dark. Oh, you know, gotcha. helicopters, okay. the police helicopters, yeah. they all have FLIR. Really? Ships, wow. yeah. I mean, FLIR is a huge conglomerate, big company, you know, that's what they Very do. Very cool. But we're glad that they got into this market and they didn't forget about the, uh, the, the job site, you know? Because basically what you're going to do is, I had an electrician over here the other day, Paul, and he was down in my panel box. I'll show you a picture. <laughs> is that code for something? <laughs> <laughs> I'll overlay it right now. But when he was in my panel box, he's like, oh, yeah, look, you got one of these that's heating up. Oh, really? Yeah. No, I did. I had one that was, was heating up. Was it the up. left or right one? Yeah, shut up. You got excited, too. Who Look wouldn't, right? No, you got excited because you're going to look for drafts and stuff at your house. Yeah, no, I am. Uh, I probably cool. would have liked to seen a cover on it, too. Just because yeah, the just job site is dust. dirty, you're throwing it in and out of your bag. You know, it would have been nice to come with a cover or a case, Yeah. which it does not. Uh, but other than that, you know, you guys, I think it's a very cool little unit. It's roughly around $500. If you if uh, recently you saw the FLIR 1, did you see that? It's an iPhone case. No. Yeah, it's an iPhone case. It's like... $300 that you can look around. Uh, really? Yeah, it turns your iPhone into a wow. iPhone 5 into a thermal imager. Uh, it's kind of like that, but That's in cool. its own style. Yeah. Huh? Built in battery, you guys, so you don't have to worry about changing batteries, anything like that. We're going to have a uh, roundup between this and the DeWalt mm -hmm. and possibly the Milwaukee. Yep. And let you guys know what we think of each of them. We're probably going to get a pro in here, just get their, their thoughts on them. But let us know what you guys think at the bottom. The FLIR TG165, definitely I'm liking it. I think it's good. I think it's cool. Yeah, it's a, it's a very cool unit so far. Yeah. I mean, I'm still in the excitement phase of playing with it, you know. Um, but we'll see what happens, you know. Yeah, um, we're going to definitely cool. uh, take it to more jobs. We, I took it to the port. There, we could. See, that's another cool thing. You could tell which cars are running. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like law enforcement, you know, if you're chasing somebody. Yeah, that's and then, a, like, you, all of a sudden, you, there's no lights. You can just go down the street and be like, oh, that car was just running. Yeah. You know, I mean, there's a really big that's, advantage that's to. Sick. I never thought about yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah. Because think about it. If you, yeah, nighttime pulling over. Yeah, well, when I came home the other night, I, like, went on my brakes, and my brakes were all warm. Okay. It was crazy. Yeah, seats here, I'll overlay right now. Those are our heated seats. That's, oh, that's cool. weird looking, yeah. Yeah, there's so many more um, things you can see with heat, with, yeah. with temperature differences and stuff like that. And that's why this is really going to aid the tradesmen, you yep. know? I mean, they're going to be able to pop this out and just with one, you know, just hold it up for one second and you're going to know your, your trouble spots. Yeah. You know, versus the other one where you have to point all around. Why are you laughing? Because I'm about to lose it with my allergies and just start yeah. completely Man, sneezing. Man, you're making me nervous. Toesandaction.com. Don't forget, Ultimate Tool Bag giveaways coming up. Let us know what you guys think at the bottom about Flare TG165. What else? That's about it. Don't forget to subscribe above, like us below. And Ultimate Tool Bag giveaways, December 25th. And that's it because I'm about to lose it right now. All right, Tools in Action. Remember, for more exciting tool action, go to toolsinaction.com. <laughs>